What's up guys? Todd of Diamond Dreams again, pitching coordinator. Um, wanted to take you guys through all of our plyo ball drills for our plyo ball series and plyo ball routine that we have all of our athletes go through before they start their catch play process. Important part here is make sure that you start in your series with the heaviest plyo ball that you have and then work your way down to the lightest plyo ball that you have. Um, we have our guy, our older athletes, our high school athletes start with a 2,000 gram ball. Um, then they'll work their way down to a ball that's about 3.5 ounces. Okay, uh, it doesn't matter if you're using grams or ounces, just as long as you're starting heavy and working your way down to light. Um, we always tell our guys throughout this process to start as close as they can to the wall and then work their way out from the wall as they go through each drill. Um, you don't need to do a lot of reps. Um, it's kind of a comfort thing and a feel thing. Um, sometimes guys will do three reps of every single drill. Sometimes guys will do 10 reps of one drill and one rep of another drill. So it's all personal preference. Um, first one though that we'll have guys do is reverse throws. And that'll be with their heaviest ball. Their back's gonna face our plyo wall. Um, we're gonna have them start with the ball. I'm right-handed, so they're gonna start with the ball on their left thigh if they're right-handed and then they're going to reverse out over their right shoulder keeping the back of their hand facing the plyo wall and they're going to watch the ball hit the wall and they're going to stay in a good postural position right here they're not going to drop the elbow down they're also not going to bring it right up here above their head so stay in your arm slot is an important part of this start on the thigh rotate back back of the hand of the wall stay in your arm slot and you can just catch this thing off the wall if you're doing it right. And that is reverse throws. 